They didn't play for the BCS Championship. It wasn't a magical year, but it was a pretty good season in 2003. I'm Pete Futak for Campus Insiders, and we're talking about the 2014 Notre Dame Fighting Irish. Here's what you need to know to be an expert. Oh, you're a clever one. It's going to be an interesting season, an interesting team coming back for Notre Dame. Their backfield's going to have to shine. Can Everett Golson become Everett Golson again of 2012? He's going to need to be, or Malik Zaire is going to take over that quarterback job. He was fantastic this spring. A lot of Irish fans want to see what he can do. Greg Bryant, is he ready to be the next star at running back? He's going to need to be because this receiving core is a little bit sketchy. The defense, the secondary is going to be phenomenal, but that defensive front's going to have a little bit of a tough time replacing Lewis Nix and Stefan to it. Again, kind of an uneven team. Let's see if they can put it all together. Doug Chapman, who's your player to watch out for? You hit it right on the head, Pete. My surprise player is quarterback Malik Zaire. He's confident. He's been there all spring. He's looked the best all spring. Yes, Golson is back, but Golson has not played football competitively in a year. Zaire's been there. He's been the guy. I don't see Golson uproot him. Golson may be the guy week one, but watch Malik Zaire be the quarterback down the stretch and finish the season. Let's take a look at that schedule. There's a lot of big names on this slate, but it's not all that bad. The key is they're going to have to hold serve at home. They can't lose to Michigan at home. They can't lose to Stanford at home. They can't lose to North Carolina. Why? Because they got to go to Florida State. They got to go to USC. They got to go to Arizona State. There's no layups. Rice won the Conference USA Championship last year. That's who they open with. They got to deal with Navy. That offense should be bigger and better than ever. It is an interesting schedule. Lots of landmines. All right, Doug Chapman, what do you have them going? Choose wisely. My pick for Notre Dame is them going 10 and 2. The Malik Zaire experiment will look good this year. They're going to get upset by Michigan, and we know they're going to lose to Florida State, but I've got them going 10 and 2. Way too uneven a team, way too many question marks, way too many holes to fill. 10 and 2 is being very, very generous, especially considering there's a sure thing lost to Florida State on here. Only two games on their schedule are against teams that didn't go bowling last year Purdue and Northwestern. Northwestern's going bowling this year. It's a tough slate. I think they go a lot worse than 10 and 2, but we'll see. I'm Pete Futek. We're breaking down all the top teams here on CampusInsiders.com.